Hello everybody and welcome to The Last Tinker, City of Colors. This is an action-adventure platformer indie game made by Mimi Me Productions that has a really charming story and a lovely, vibrant visual thing going on for it, and I really adore it. I played a little bit of it. It feels like an homage to like Donkey Kong, Collect-a-Thon, Banjo-Kazooie style games, and it's really... It, it, there's nothing that's been made like it too much recently, and I think it's really refreshing. But let's just jump into the cutscene and show you guys why it's so great. Tinker World. A place where everything can be built from basic materials. As long as the idea behind it is strong enough. From ancient forests to bustling cities. From the tallest mountain to the deepest ocean. All is crafted with nothing more than color, paper and glue. Even small pets, or giant ones. Paint is produced in the City of Colors and brings life to the inhabitants of Tinkerwell. Everybody has a favorite shade, which makes them individual. But now, the city is in danger. Fortitude has turned to sadness, curiosity to fear, and strength to anger. People have divided the city into districts, even starting to hate other colors. Only in the outer district, where all colors are accepted, are people still normal. But among them lives a boy with very special talents. Soon, he will start a chain of events that will destroy the city. Right. Now we gotta get started and I get to show you the lovely visuals. Really great. Kinda reminds me of like a Viva Pinata almost in a very good way. Especially this guy right here definitely reminds me of Viva Pinata. Hey. Oh, and there we are. Koru again. Why do you always scare your old pal Tap like that? Mm. Come on now. It's race time. First, let's register down at the booth. Don't bother warming up. I'll coach you on the way. And the thing to note, this game is a PC game. It's coming to the PlayStation 4 pretty soon. I am playing it on the PC with a PlayStation 3 controller, but it thinks it's an Xbox controller because I'm adapting it. It's, a, it's confusing, but that's just how I've, I choose to play. I'm really comfortable with the PlayStation controller myself. Sorry, Koro. The gate's jammed again. I'll probably take a few hours to fix. Oh boy, business as usual. It looks like we're taking the long way around again. It'll be nice warm up for the race. Oh gosh, have you seen a game quite as vibrant as this? I have not, and I love it. Ah, There's very interesting characters too. And a rockin' soundtrack. Here we go, we hold the trigger button to kind of like auto jump over these gaps like this. Not just being a professional jumper right here. Oh, here we go. Got a floaty brush. This is the game's collectible that we're gonna be able to uh, get along the way. Sort of encourage exploration, which is lovely. I always approve of that sentiment. All right. Oh my gosh, I cannot get over it. This entire first episode is probably going to be just me complimenting the game as much as I can possibly find ways. Hey, Koru! Your health sun is displayed in the upper left. If you fall into the water, you lose health and respond at the edge. If you lose all your health, you travel back to the latest tinker seed. Alright. Uh-oh, uh-oh. I went for it. I went for it. I did not want to go for it. Presenting us with our first real danger. Let's jump. Let's just take a break right here. I'm a monkey, by the way. I'm not just a funny-looking man. I'm pretty sure I am... Like, I'm 90% sure I'm quite monkey. I got this nice outfit. I should start jumping. Oh my, that sun is happy as hell. Oh, I want to be going this way. I want to be going this way. I don't know if I'm going to make it. Well, that's all right. That's not a big deal. Why'd I do it again? All right, I'm going around to the right. This octopus looks quite, I don't want to say it. He looks quite lovely. Let's go with that. Everything looks just so nice and crafted like, like you know like the lore suggests 
punch. Punch. Uh. Across the rope. Bye, birds. It's a nice touch. What is this back there? What do you mean? What's that back there? Oh, back there. It's a floaty brush, you dum dum. You know exactly what it is. Hey, this is a floaty brush. I'm told somebody in the market district is keen on collecting these things. All right. Oh. Where are we off to? Which one did we come from? Where do we come from? Where do we go? Oh! Where do we come from? I don't know. Probably right. Oh, yeah! That was powerful. That was exciting as heck. All right. I just feel... I feel good about this. Like, the... Combat targeting feels responsive. All the controls seem to make sense. It's just nice. It is just nice. Yo! Go to... The gate's broken, is it? I thought so when I heard you're smashing our crates again. But you can baby back after you won the race today, deal? Now into the jump pad with ya. Uh, uh, I wonder if that would not happen if I didn't actually break any of the crates. Where are we off to? Probably over here? Ah! It really is something, Koru. Good luck in the race. Do we have any more floaty brushes hidden over here? This seems like it would be a good sp uh, spot for it. Aha! Uh -huh. I am a genius when it comes to floaty brushes. Floaty brush master! Can we make this jump? Yeah. Nice! I feel... I feel really proud of myself. Art monkey fiend! I am a great wizard! Prepare yourself for my color magic! You shall not pass! Ah -ha -ha -ha. Sorry, Goru, I couldn't tell myself is not what I'm actually saying, but that wizard outfit you made me is amazing. Thank you so much. You're amazing at tinkering. Here's 30 gems for your trouble. I'll go and show you this to my friends. Good luck in the race. What a fool. I like the characters a lot. Whoa. I like this too. Can I punch? Yes. Oh, it makes such a disappointing noise. It's like a bunny turtle. Mimi. I wonder if... What if it's saying me 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 because of the 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 people who created the game? That'd be that'd be an interesting little Easter egg touch. Hello, hey guys, behold ye mighty wizard! <laughs> oh look at this! <laughs> God, I can't. Looks like Shrek had a baby with a bulldog and then got covered in paint. Koru, Dad, what can I do for you? We're here to register for the race. All right, that'll be 500 gems. What? Since when have you been charging canal runners? Sorry, guys, but the district is in such bad state. Tension between the other districts are affecting us, too. If they don't produce any color, we'll have nothing to paint with, so we have to earn crystals in any way we can. It looks like we have to get some crystals, and fast. The people at the tavern may have some work for us. Press up on the directional pad and I'll show you the way. <laughs> I, I understand that some people might not have, or might have a problem with this kind of system, but I don't think, I don't think I have a problem because, well, it's completely optional for one. You just, if I want, I can never use that and find the tavern, but it's good for things like this. Koru, tap, how's it going? Hey guys, do you know who can have some work for us? We need 500 gems to enter the race. That's new. Doesn't surprise me that in these times, anyway, I've been helping Muddy out down at the Mushroom Farm. Today's my day off, so you could probably help him instead. Rick is organizing a new fighting workshop today. He asked for you personally, Koru. Maybe you can do something for him. Thanks, guys. Let's go, Koru. Remember, press up on the directional pad and I'll show you the way. Yep, okay. Everybody wants to remind me that I can press up on the directional pad. And, Kor <laughs> and Tap will show me the way. Ooh, you lose all your health, you start back at the last Tinker Seed. Pretty standard. Ooh, gah! Hey, Goro, you're on your way to the farm, I presume. I'm doing another fighting workshop day. If you'd like to join, it's the same place as usual. Just use the cargo rail up at the station. 
but oh. oh goodness me gracious oh staring at me go through me that's what he's thinking he's go through me I love it all right punch Oop, I'm going the wrong way I feel like there's I think I could probably split off into two different directions now yep I could have gone there I could have gone there wouldn't have been the worst thing in the world ah woo oh this is lovely can I jiggle I can I can jiggle a little bit I think I'm doing a little bit of, yep I can jiggle don't worry guys I can jiggle this game has jiggle physics not the same ones you're probably thinking of. Need to talk to Brick. Is Brick the red? Brick is the red. It looks so cool, but what's stopping them from tipping over? Oh, that's a very good point. Doesn't quite make sense, does it? Goro, I was hoping you'd come. The others were waiting inside. Hey. Hello? Oh, here we go. There you are. Teach me how to... It's more of you every day. It's good to know people are willing to stand up against the bullies. On the red district. Alright, everyone. Let's limber up. Make sure you go through all the exercises. No skipping. Let's go, people. Alright. What do you have to say? Oh, hello. I'm new here. You're Koru, right? Can you help me figure out this test? I think Brick said, do a five-hit combo. Hit every dummy at least once. But never hit one twice in a row. I'm so confused. Maybe you can do it. Two, three, ah. Boom, 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 boom. Done. Get out of here. What do you have? Koru, is that you? Guess what I've set up? A new record. 14 hits in a row. Impressed? Good. I dare you to beat that. Oh, gosh, he's got a lovely, beautiful singing voice, doesn't he? Five, three, four, five. Can't see it. Two, three, four, five. All right. Last but not least, Koru. You here to do some dodging? Okay, then show me what you can do. First, I want to see three practice dodges. Use both. L and uh, that's not even correct for me, but huh. there we go. How do you do it, Koro? Can't even get half that far. Eh, it's time for dodge punch practice. You know the drill, of course. Choose a target and show me three dodge punches. Dodge towards the target and press B. Huh. Boom. Huh. Boom. For those of you who are curious, it's uh, R2, R1, and circle on my controller. Done enough dodging, Koru. Good job. Alright. It looks like you're ready for the fight, Koru. I have something special planned for you this time. Step into the center of the ring when you're ready. Ooh. Who's gonna fight? Anybody gonna fight? Alright, people. Listen up. We all know Koru's the best fighter here. Let's give him a bit of a challenge today. You'll be fighting him in groups. Koru, show them what you're made of. Ooh, 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 ooh. Ah, hey, ha, he, he, he. Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry to that poor guy who was already down. Next. Try countering incoming blows. Hit your opponents before they attack. Hey, hey, hey. Boom, boom, boom. Ooh. That's a nice. Ooh, I didn't know about this. You don't need to be running while you're while you're fighting to do a dodge. You're ready to face more opponents. Keep dodging. R B. Who's the dodge punch? Then B. All right. Huh. Yep. Okay. I can in fact do it without even running, which is very good. If I had to be running in combat, that would be a little bit silly. Definitely working well. Nice. Monitor your health close. Collect health crystals if you need them. Fight around, Koru. It's a good all you got. Uh, ooh, nice. Boom, boom. Boom. 
Boom. And, uh-oh, gonna get hit? No, we're not. Not even gonna get hit. Or we might have got hit once, I couldn't tell. You're a real piece of work, kid, I guess. There's nothing more I can teach you. Here's 250 gems for showing what others... Other what real fine is. Also take these. These gloves prove that you learned your skills from me. Ah, they lovely. You're ready to use your skills on the street now. Protect yourself and others. Never lose your temper. Now go and show those bullies a thing or two. All right. So that about does it for the first episode of The Last Tinker City of Colors. Thank you everybody for watching, and since this is the first episode, it would be extra great if you could leave a like if you appreciated the video. If you got all the way to the end, I assume you liked it a little bit. If you want to leave a comment down below, saying your opinions or any questions you have about the game, I can try to get to them. I really love to respond to any questions and stuff you guys have. So thank you all for watching. Thank you, thank you. I really, really appreciate it.